is Christy and I'm here with a box for Operation Christmas Child of course. This one's for a girl two to four and it is a three rubber band box and the reason for that is because it has a giant plush. So I was anticipating very, for a very long time packing these giant plush and I just have put it off because I thought it would be too hard. But it turns out, as long as you have enough little gems on hand, it comes together beautifully. And I know the children who receive these big plush are going to be thrilled with them. I, I just can't imagine because some of these are so big. But the trick is to squeeze down the air with the rubber bands. Basically, I just lean my whole body on it and push down and it works. So here it is. Here's the lovely, beautiful llama, perfect purple llama. Look how big. It's even plumping up, pluff, plumping up as I hold it. So I love the color of the teal and the purple and the so cute face with the big eyes and lots of fluff. So definitely the star of the box, but we have a lot of other items right here in the shoe box that are also gonna be exciting. Let me see, I think she stands up just fine, but she hasn't finished plumping up. Okay, so inside, look at all of these things I still have. It's not just a plain box with one thing. It has, it's a well-rounded box, just like all my other boxes. So first of all, pull out some of the flat things. They are leaning leaning against the back lid, the coloring book, God Loves You coloring book, and the puzzle game. Both of these can be printed off on blessingsandissuebox.com, available for anyone that goes on there. It's just such a great resource. I have used it almost every day now for several months. So th check out blessingsandissuebox.com. She has this beautiful little green bow. She has a wooden car, one of my favorites to put in a shoebox for the toddlers. She has these cute polka dot sunglasses. This is the second time I've put them in a box and I just love them. She has a pair of bike shorts and a mustache whistle, purple. I was trying to pull out a lot of purple things. And she has a foldable flying disc and a rattle, a star rattle that's purple. And this that I'm gonna bring out is one of the, my favorite, favorite items. It's good for every age and it fits great in a shoebox, a great little gem. These wooden robots, I love them. They can um, color out or draw on them or they can leave them plain. They're just really fun. There's a white scrunchie. Here's her cup, so she has a cup and a spoon. She still has all of her essentials. She has a pair of black socks. She has a bright multicolored squeezy ball that kind of looks like a beach ball in here. She has a shirt from Old Navy, 4T, really cute little floral shirt. She has her Headband. I love it when I see those girls putting on headbands on those Operation Christmas Child videos. There's a half composition book. All of her school supplies are in here. She has this cute little toddler tote with a hippo on it. Um, she has one marker. It's this bright pink. And her toothbrush over here on the side. Whoops. And then she has a pair of underwear. She has a 16 pack of crayons. She has a sharpener that has a lid on it. And then she has a blanket. I was so excited to include this soft blanket. Not all the, the blankets at Dollar Tree are soft, but I happen to pick up several of these and it does have a llama on it. It has multiple animals, zebra, sloth, rabbit, elephant, but it has a turtle. It has a, um, a uh, llama, it's like a white, oh, here it is, real pale pink. So super, um, I was really super excited to find a llama on there. 
And then she has her school supply pouch with 10 pencils and a big pink eraser and scissors right here so that it would lay flat. Oh, there it goes. And um, the last but not least, a washcloth the same size as the llama. So I was very excited to get all of this in, in addition to the wow, super wow, lush, huge plush. And I just, I'm so happy to share it with you and hopefully it gives you some ideas. But before you leave, I want to mention that tomorrow my husband's video is gonna be up. He made four older boy tool toolboxes and hopefully tonight or tomorrow morning we'll, we'll be able to film those. But those are so cool. So I want you to be able to see those two. Don't miss out. So thanks for watching. Thank you for uh, packing shoe boxes. And I hope you'll consider packing shoe boxes with a big plush to make a big wow factor. So let me know in the comments below what you're doing now that it's getting close to the deadline. I'm packing just a few more shoe boxes and then I'm going to really go full force on my fillers. But I've also been spending my evenings writing lots and lots of wonderful love letters. So it's just a great time of year and I love Operation Christmas Child and the gospel is going to be going forth very soon with all of these shoe boxes. And so I'm covering it with lots of prayer. So thank you for watching. God bless you and bye for now.